Hello, welcome to this FB4DS.com video tutorial. Today's Facebook video tip is going to be on using Woobox, which is a third party app, to run a contest on Facebook that you base on comments or likes. And it's, this is a way to do it for free. So if you want to run a contest where you say comment on this picture or this post or like this post to be entered to win, this is how you can do it. There's lots of different ways, but this is just one way um, that I'm going to show you today. If you like this uh, format, you like these video tips, please continue to subscribe um, on the, either the fan page, there's a direct link, or you can go directly to videotips.fbfords.com. You can um, go directly to our fan page by just going to fbfords.com. That will actually send you over to the fan page to get uh, tips I post in there every day. So this is going to be using Woobox, which is a third-party app. There's actually many apps to choose from. This one can be accessed at their website, www.woobox.com. You can see a recommended list of all the apps I recommend for doing these types of things. Some are free, some are paid. Um, I have a little description of each of their features by going to apps.fbfords.com. So what you want to do is click on, um, from the Woobox uh, website, click on the Get Started for Free button up in the top right corner. It's a green button. And you want to make sure that you're logged in as your personal prof profile. If you are logged in as your page, uh, you will see this prompt. Will, it will ask you to switch accounts and to be using it as your personal profile as opposed to your business page. So just click on the Switch button. You're going to want to grant that app some access. A couple of prompts will come up ask, asking for access to your personal profile as well as um, to manage your pages. You're going to click OK on both of those and you'll end up at the Woobox dashboard. Now if you manage more than one page, you will have to select that page from the top there. If you only manage one, then that should be the one you see there. But if you have more than one page that you're an admin for, just click on the drop down there at the top and click on Change Business. And then you'll be given a list of all the pages that you manage uh, with this account. And you can select the one that you want to work with today. So click on that and then you'll be confirmed and know that that's what you, um, you're working with the right page because now you'll see that at the top on the menu bar. Uh, as well as on the left side um, sidebar there you'll see it. So once you have the page set that you want to work with to do your contest and you want to select the post that's going to be the winner that you're going to choose the winner from, you want to click on posts. Posts is a menu option there at the top menu bar of Woobox. Click on posts and that's going to take you to all the posts that are on that page. Uh, your most recent posts will be shown at the top and they'll be dated there. Now if you don't see the most recent posts you may need to refresh so just click on the refresh post button. It's another green button up on the top right. Once you do that and you scroll down to the post that you are uh, doing the contest for, click on pick winner. You'll notice right below pick winner there's a few options to do um, some exporting. You can export your likes and your comments and some um, other things like that. So check that out. There's some little options there that you can do. And that's also free with this. Um, this is one of the free parts of Woobox. Okay, so you want to click on pick winner. And it will actually let you know that you can create a prize claim where it's a kind of a little feature that they offer. But this is a paid feature, something that you will need to upgrade your account for. That's not what we're going to do today. You want to scroll down a bit to where you see pick a winner. And just above picking a winner, you're going to enter some criteria. And you'll select the criteria that you want this contest to be based on. Is it based on likes, commenting? Um, and then if you do select that this is based on commenting, there'll be another option where you can determine whether users can only enter once per comment um, or via comment. Meaning if they commented three times, that doesn't give them three entries into the contest. It's just for commenting whether once or many times that they're entered into it. So select your criteria and then just click on pick a winner and your winner will be displayed there at the bottom. So what you'll see is the winners, a link to their um, pay, their profile and you know picture and their name and then over to the right it'll let you know how the winner was selected, was it a comment, was it a like and you also have the option to unpick this winner and that might be good for example when I do this sometimes actually all the time I am also commenting on a post where I'm selecting winners. I'll say you know tell me what your you know, favorite color is in our product line and then when 
when my fans comment, I'm going to reply to their comments. So it's counting me as a comment when it does this. So there's a chance you as the page owner might be selected as the winner. If that happens, that's when you want to use this unpick feature. So unpick yourself and then when you do that, it'll give you the option to pick another winner until you actually um, get a fan that's actually a fan and not yourself or an admin of your page. So once you do that, it'll let you know that it's up to you to notify your winners. This is not something that uh, Woobox does automatically where it will notify your winner for you. That is a feature they offer, but it's for a paid account. It is not a free feature. So it's letting you know that it's up to you to contact your winners. And there are the right and wrong ways to do it. So there are ideas um, to how to do this legally within Facebook guidelines so you're following the rules. Um, and there's links to how um, information on how you can do that in the description area of this video. So check those out for some tips on how to do that. But it's up to you to contact your winner. And then um, on the left side bar, just be sure to check out some other options. You can do like check how many hashtag counts you have. You can export information. So there's other options you can do. There's a little, quite a few things you could do free with Woobox. So I really like this app. That's why I do a lot of video tutorials on it. But basically that's it. That's the gist of setting up a con um, selecting a winner when you set up a contest on your Facebook fan page to determine um, when it's based on comments or likes. Again, if you like this, please be sure to subscribe to our videos, videotips.fb for ds.com. Become a fan at fb4ds.com. And if you want to get in on my next free training webinar, you can sign up at freetraining.fb4ds.com. I'm currently only doing two webinars per year. And um, so check that out. Um, subscribe in to get the next free training, and then you'll get a notification when the next one's coming around. And I'd love to see you on that. Thanks for tuning in, and I really hope this was helpful. Until next time, take care, guys. Thanks.